That was friggin' awesome. All right, so check this out. There's a great gray owl in the tree over here. And then there's this cool stump that's out in the um, meadow over here. And I've lined myself up so that I've got a nice dark background out here with the stump. The owl's facing straight at me here. And I'm like super hopeful that maybe the owl's going to fly in and land on this stump. There's beautiful light coming through the forest uh, lighting up this little stump. So I set myself up so there's a nice dark background. And if that owl comes in here, I've got my exposure locked for the brightness of the sun. And if it comes and lands on that stump, it'll be coming pretty much straight at me with its wings flared and its talons out. So that's, that's the shot I'm visualizing here. Like 90% chance that won't happen, but the 10% chance that it will happen, it would be freaking awesome. So I'm gonna plant myself right here, get my exposure locked in, get my focus set up and ready right uh, on that stump, and then just hope that maybe that owl decides it wants to go land on that stump. That would be freaking amazing. So hopefully you can see that out there. See the owl and the stump? It's a cool little setup here. We'll see if it works or not, but uh, I like it. There's always a chance. Shoot! So the sun went down and I was waiting here, waiting, waiting. About an hour and a half, I sat here and waited for that owl to fly onto that cool little log. Which little log? Yep, that little log that the owl is now sitting on. And uh, yeah, once the sun went down, I kind of, I dropped my guard a little bit. I uh, just lost focus, I guess, and uh, I hate to say it, but I just missed the shot. Oops. Anyway, it did exactly what I thought it was going to do. It flew in and landed right on that log, on that stump, and uh, I just missed the shot. But anyway, now it's hunting here, so I might still get a shot or two out of this. It's just looking right out in this meadow like it sees something. So I'm going to put this camera down and hopefully not miss the next shot. Ugh, shame on me. That was friggin' awesome. The owl's back on his perch. <laughs> he hopped off that perch and landed right here. Five feet in front of me. And caught a little, I think it was a little meadow vole. Uh, it was all happening so fast. <laughs> I was so excited. I'm not even sure what it was. And it flew back up in the perch and ate its little prey. Unbelievable. Now it's just sitting there in gorgeous light. So I'm taking a little portrait of it facing straight at me here with the beautiful, just pitch dark background. Man, what an awesome time out here. I, I totally blew that first shot. 
when it flew in and landed there. And that would have been fantastic. But I hung in there and waited even longer. It's really dark. I was shooting wide open at about ISO 4000. I'd have to double check that. Hopefully I have enough shutter speed to have gotten some reasonable uh, sharpness on the bird as it came in after that vol. I flipped it over to video real quick. Watched it grab that vol out of the grass and then fly back up to the perch. Uh, just magic out here. Absolute magic. Yeah, such a beautiful bird and such a beautiful scene out here tonight. I'm lucky man. I get to come do this. It's amazing. Thanks for watching. Have a good night. See ya.